Back in late 2017, we explored how long it took to unlock everything in Rainbow Six Siege when it was on the white noise patch. In March 2018, Ubisoft brought fundamental changes to Rainbow Six Siege's progression system with Operation Chimera. Renown costs were removed for weapon attachments and for the initial roster of operators, a change we had recommended in a previous video. Our old video is no longer accurate and we need to revisit the subject How long does Rainbow Six Siege take to unlock everything after Operation Chimera? If you have not bought any season passes, you have 18 operators to unlock as of Operation Chimera, each of them going for 25,000 renown. To calculate how long it will take to unlock all of them, we will use figures from research conducted by a YouTuber named Technical Gaming. What I got was for casual matches, I got 197 average, and the average time that it took was 16 minutes and 6 seconds. Now for ranked matches, I got an average of 343 renown, and that is with an average time of 20 minutes and 27 seconds. We're going to take 25,000, which is the cost of a DLC operator in Rainbow Six Siege, and we will divide that by the average that we got for each game, which was 197. And if you calculate that, then it'll come out to be about 127. So that's going to be 127 games that you're going to have to play in order to get a DLC operator. And that is if you're just playing casual. If you play strictly casual, it will take you 2,286 casual matches to unlock everything. This amounts to 36,684 minutes or 611 hours of grinding. To calculate competitive, we're going to literally do the exact same thing except just using competitive numbers. So 25,000, which is the amount it costs for a DLC operator, divide that by 343 renown, which is the average amount of renown you're getting per game. And what you're going to get is about 73. And what we're going to come out with is 1,477 minutes. And if we divide that by 60, then we are going to get 24.6, so about 24 and a half hours. If you play strictly ranked, it will take you 1,314 ranked matches to unlock everything. In terms of time, this equates to 26,586 minutes, or 443.1 hours of grinding through ranked matches. If you have bought one or more season passes, your grind will be significantly shorter as all operators in your purchase season are unlocked immediately. Let's measure precisely how much time you'll save with these passes. If you have bought one season pass for either of the completed years, the year 1 or year 2, you reduce the number of operators you need to unlock from 18 to 10. The total renown you need to accumulate to unlock everything is 250,000. Unlocking everything will take you 1,270 matches if you play strictly casual, or 730 matches if you play strictly rank. Playing only casual matches sets the time needed to unlock everything at 20,380 minutes, or nearly 339.6 hours. If you play only ranked, you'll spend 14,770 minutes, or 246 hours to unlock everything. If you have bought season passes for both year 1 and year 2, you only have to unlock the two new operators introduced in Operation Chimera, reducing the renown needed to 50,000. This would take you 254 matches if you play strictly casual, or 146 matches if you play strictly ranked. If you play only ranked, unlocking everything will take you 2,954 minutes, or around about 49.2 hours. If you play only casual, you'll spend 4,076 minutes, or about 68 hours, on unlocking everything. If you're late to the party and have bought only Season Pass 3, you still have 16 operators from the first two years to unlock. Your Season Pass grants you a 10% discount at the store until the year expires, which brings the total renown cost of all DLC operators down from 400,000 to 360,000. Your 5% renown boost raises technical gaming's measured averages to 207 renown per casual game and 360 renown per ranked match. With these rates, you will spend 1700 139 casual matches or 1000 ranked matches to unlock everything. If you play strictly casual, this will take you 27,998 minutes or about 467 hours of continuous grinding before you have everything unlocked. If you play strictly ranked, the time needed to unlock everything comes to 20,450 minutes or around 341 hours.
The complete edition finally lives up to its name, unlocking everything instantly at least until 2019. If you had already spent a lot of time unlocking attachments and launch operators during tough luck, Ubisoft has said technical limitations stopped them from refunding renown for players who already acquired these attachments and operators. Peculiarly, technical limitations did not stop them from refunding renown from ACOG sites they removed from Bandit and Jaguar's guns. If Ubisoft could overcome these limitations and issue refunds for launch operators and attachments, how much renown would you receive? The spreadsheet we put together in our last progression analysis gives us the answer. Unlocking all attachments as of white noise would set you back to 116,310. For the same amount, you could unlock 4 DLC operators right away and shave over half of the time needed to unlock the fifth. Unlocking all the launch operators would have cost you 25,000 renown, exactly equal to the renown needed to unlock one DLC operator. Put together, you could have unlocked at least 5 DLC operators immediately and have 16,310 renown left over with the renown cost of the content now available for free. This assumes you are a completionist and had unlocked everything prior to the Operation Chimera. This video is not applicable to the starter edition, which uses a significantly different progression model. Our next video will analyze the grind in the starter edition, so please like, subscribe and hit the bell icon so you don't miss out. Even though our calculations are accurate for the normal editions, our estimates do not account for additional renown you can obtain through completing challenges and playing during bonus events that Ubisoft pulls from time to time. We have already covered challenges in significant detail in two previous videos, so feel free to check them out for additional analysis and tips. Thank you for watching, please like, share and subscribe for more.